Hello guys, my name is Tim Demoni Andrew, and I'm a data analyst for your busy edge. So for today's section, we will create a feedback form for our online webinars using the Microsoft Form Online. So the first thing I will do, I will go to my Excel Online. I say I go to my browser, I will search for Excel Online. Go to my Excel Online. I create a blank workbook and if I continue, if I continue, the Microsoft form is only available for people using Office 365. So I'm in my Excel online. This is an Excel this is an online platform for Excel. You can see this is the sheet, this sheet one. I can, I can click here and create more sheet. But what I'm trying to do, I'm trying to create a Microsoft form. So I come to insert. You can see the form. It's already there on the Excel itself. So I just come here, I click on the form. I, I like I click on new forms. So you can see this book. So it says book two, showing book two, right? So I change the name to feedback form. I can put a little bit of description. Let's put webinar feedback. So I'm going to put my company's logo in this place. You can also insert image. I'll put my company's logo here. I'll go to upload. I'll go to my desktop. I'll go to your piece edge. Press OK. It's loading, it's loading, it's loading. So what do I actually, what do I actually plan to do? I'm trying to create like a feedback form for our online webinar. So the first thing I click on add here. So what I want to ask, I want to ask for the person's name. So I'll go to text. Say first name. First name is just a text. It's not something much. So you can see, you can see here the word long long answer required is actually required. So I like the required. So the required has been highlighted. Add another one again. I call this a new. I call this gentle. So I'll call this gentle. Say male, female, and mm, add others. So I think we don't need gender. So let's see other ones. Let's click on new again. Let's click on choice. Uh, let me ask what webinar section. What webinar section? So I, will, I like to drop down. There's a drop down for this. So I click on these three dots here. I like to drop down. So now it's a drop down. So I say, our webinar, we actually offer three courses. That's Excel. Power BI, so Power BI, last one is financial modeling. So, finish those are the three. So, next question I'll ask let me use something else, tell me something different. Let me use a link like her. Show the like, let me use a like her. Ask how. Of some how often, sorry, how often do you use this? So, okay, let me see the first one of the Excel. Excel. It's required. So, how often do you use Excel? Is it daily, weekly, monthly, seasonal, yearly, or never? So, the next question I'll ask I'll make it a choice. Was this topic relevant? 
So let me say what is section running runs to you. So this will be question mark. I'll make the drop down. If yes or no. Yes or no. So let me go to the next one. So say if no. If no. Give reasons for your selection. So let me just try it's gonna be a text. So this one person can write as long as many reasons as they want. So let me just make it a long answer. So it's gonna be a long answer. So the next question is rate the speaker. So I'm saying rate the speaker. And it's gonna be star, it's like this star. Okay, let's say one to five symbol star. Star is preferable. Okay, let me say under rating. Say rate the session. So the same thing. Let me add another one again. You can also there are so many things, there are so many features. You can use text, rating, dates, you can use ranking like uh, you can also upload files just like saying you also to drop the resume or something you can do net scores on the rest so let me just use let me use net scores here okay let me see let me say wait yourself yourself after this section I said not so great. Not so great, I'll say awesome. Awesome. Okay, that's nice. Um let me let me add one more let say let me add another text. Say any any suggestion of a suggestion or comments. This is better. Um, let me make it a long text. A long text, that's nice. So let me see. This shouldn't be compulsory. This shouldn't be compulsory. Yeah? This shouldn't be compulsory. We're just trying to make Choose which one should be composed and which one shouldn't be. So you can see the first name, gender, what webinar section. How often do you use any of these tools? That's Excel, Power BI, Financial Modeling. What was this section relevant to you? If no, read the speaker, read the section, read yourself after the section. Any suggestion or comments? I think that's all. Let me preview. Let me check it in the preview. So you can say first name. I'm saying Andrew. Okay. You. Okay. I'm saying financial modeling. How often? Okay. Yes. With the speaker. Give it a three star. A three star. I'm getting a half rate here. Yeah. All good. So let's see. Let me submit. Thank you for your response. I think it's okay. So let me just go back. So let me change. Let me add some little bit of design. Let me change the team. Let's see this. Is one okay? Okay, it's not quite bad. Let me try this. Okay, this one is better. Okay, this is better. This is actually better. So you can see the response I just gave. You can see the response here. So it's not show on my Excel backhand. So this you see the same thing here. You can see when I created the sheet, when I created the form, gave me a form sheet here. So this was the description I was giving right now. All the details I gave is it. I don't know, I actually did myself. So let me still go back to the form. It's nice, not bad, not bad. 
for slave. Everything is showing. So let's come to the dot. This three three dots here. Let's check it out. So you can see some other features like settings and the rest. Let's see the settings. Who can fill the form? Let's say anyone. Anyone can fill the form. That's anyone that's the link. So that options yes. Accept response yes. This one, if you're giving like just like say you're doing a promo, you have a start and end date. Or shuffling questions. I don't think we need all this. This was the we basically did the basic for it now. So let's check. Let's see if we can share. So you can share. Anyone can respond. That's why I changed the previous one. Anyone can respond. Only people in my organization, specific people in my organization, but I give anyone can respond. So this is a URL link. So you can see this barcode here. Wow. You can also embed it. Okay, that's cool. You can also say it as an email. Oh, that's very, very nice. So, I've actually copied the link. Let me see now. Let me open the link in another browser. Let me use my Chrome. Let's see, my Chrome first. Let's see if it works. Um, let me use my Chrome. Wow, this is much. The link is much actually. Wow, voila. It worked, it worked pretty well, pretty, pretty fine. Okay, I hope you guys had fun and learned something new. So this video was brought to you by Your Biz Edge. Thank you guys and have fun.